What is this? Like a siphonophore? Yep. Wow. Oh, how cool. What? Let me. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, that's awesome. I can't believe that's a living thing. <laughs> of the body looks different from the latter. So for those of you viewing, we think this might be a siphonophore. I'm taking like crazy frame grabs right now. <laughs> that's great. <laughs> is that what the back end of it's supposed to look like? Or is it hurt? No, I think this is it's this full wide. It's supposed to be that way. That's amazing. I thought it was an old tire. Yeah, I thought it was like a plastic BFC bag or something. Usually, uh, the best known of these siphonophores are the is a what? Portuguese man of war, and that's actually much longer than whatever we're seeing right now. So, oh, the Portuguese man of war. There, some of them are not that big. Okay. <laughs> So I, I can read you the, the I'm sure you know the description of the siphonophore, but for the viewers, it's uh, an order of the hydrozoa, which is a class of marine animals belonging to the phylum Cnidaria. And although a siphonophore appears to be a single organism, each specimen is actually a colony composed of many individual animals. Most colonies are long, thin, transparent, pelagic floaters. 